Welcome to the adding rubrics to a Dropbox and using it to grade demo. In this demo, you will learn how to attach a rubric to your Dropbox folder. Then you will learn how to use the rubric to grade your students' submitted assignments. By the end of this demo, you will have graded students' assignments using a rubric that you have already built. See our video on how to build rubrics if you haven't already built one. First, log in to your Detail Brightspace account and go into your course. Make sure that you have published your rubric so that the rubric will be available to connect to the Dropbox. On the course navigation bar, click on the Course Tools drop down menu. Then choose the Dropbox link. To add a rubric to a Dropbox folder, you will start by clicking on the drop down menu next to the Dropbox folder. Then select Edit Folder from the menu. Under the Properties tab, in the Rubric section, click the Add Rubric button. In the window that opens, mark the box next to the rubric that you would like to use to grade this assignment. Then click the Add Selected button. Your rubric will be listed under the Add Rubric button. Next, set it as the default rubric. To remove this rubric, you can click the X to the right of it. Click the Save and Close button. You have now successfully added a rubric to a Dropbox folder. To use the rubric to grade the student submissions in the Dropbox, start by clicking on the name of the Dropbox folder. Then, choose the Evaluate link for the student you want to grade. On the right side of the screen, under Evaluation, you will see a section called Rubrics. Click on the name of the rubric you attach to this Dropbox folder. The rubric will open in a new window. Click the circles to mark the criteria this student has met for this assignment. Notice that each time you click a circle, that box is highlighted and the score for that criteria is entered in the far right column. Click on the Edit Pencil to add specific feedback in each row. For example, Well done! I'm glad to see such improvement. Then click the Save button. Once you have selected a score for each criteria, an overall score will automatically be entered. Click on the Edit Pencil to add overall feedback. Example, Wow! Great job! Then click the Save button. If the box next to Transfer Rubric Feedback to General Feedback for the assignment is checked, this will put any new feedback you type into the rubric rows directly into the General Feedback for the Dropbox. Click the Save and Record button you will see that the feedback and score from the rubric is automatically entered into the Dropbox feedback and score areas. Click the Publish button. Use the Previous or Next student links to grade other students, or the Back to Folder Submissions button to return to the Dropbox folder list. You have now successfully used a rubric to grade a student's Dropbox assignment. Let me show you what this looks like from the student view. You won't see this, but this is what your students see. Your student goes to the Dropbox. Under the Feedback column, clicks on the word View. The student is shown the rubric with the sections you chose highlighted and showing the feedback you wrote at the end of each row.